know that DSA is able to already fund clubs for whatever they need. But this does not extend to them uh, lending money to the students for them to, for them to be able to raise their own money. Now, uh, for this, we, we plan on implementing club loans, which would allow the students to borrow money from the student council to be able to stimulate their growth, for them to be able to raise money for themselves, for their programs, for them not to be dependent on the DSA uh, for most, if not all the time. Thank you. students and clubs to really interact with each other. These, clubs weeks don't, these club weeks don't necessarily have to be done by a single club. They can be collaborations between clubs. So, and even UNLAD will help in formulating plans for the club week activities. We're going to be involved in every way we can be and we'll support each club in design. Your one minute starts now. Uh, as you know, everybody pays uh, yearly to contribute to the SE fund, so that's where we will get our funds for all our projects. And like the current um, report on the earnings and expenses of the student council, uh, there will be a spreadsheet, very accessible and very easy to configure that would show the inflows and outflows of the money in the student council for each project that we're going to hold. Thank you. Thank you. Transparency in where, like, so the student body will know where our money is coming from and where it's going. We plan to implement as has been done this school year, an online auditing where we're going to upload a spreadsheet of where our money comes from and where it's going. And to add to this, we also want to ensure that the, the, the student body understands why this amount of money was spent on this project. So we also plan on explaining why we spent a certain amount of money for a certain amount of um, activities.